Our main weather is brought to you by the Blue Alpaca Ranch and Store. Visit our ranch and meet the alpacas or shop in our store in downtown Belfast. All right, folks, we made it. The snow event has arrived. Be careful out there, though, as road conditions are still in pretty poor shape. We do have winter weather advisories out till around 9 a.m. Uh, tomorrow. And same story for those winter storm mornings. They are actually going to expire just a bit, tad bit earlier till around 4 a.m. Waterville, Augusta, same thing by the coast into Rockland as Several more inches of snow will be piling up. Those darker blue colors are setting up just west of town right now. That's going to continue to push this way. So we will all get in on those moderate bands of snow. And then by tomorrow morning, things finally start to clear out. But not for long, though. Another system is right behind it. Even Boston got in on a little bit of snow. One of my buddies lives just outside of town, said it's been snowing all day, but it's not really accumulating as temperatures slightly above freezing. So, of course, it's hard for all that snow to pile up. Here in town, though, temperatures are well below freezing, so everything is sticking. Tonight, same story. We're looking at snow lingering till those morning hours, maybe around the morning rush. That's when the snow is finally going to be moving out. Then we're in the clear just a few hours once again. Overnight, we do get some more snow on the way. And then on Thursday, it looks like possibly a little bit of rain will be mixing in. In general, though, for the most part, this will be an all-snow event with a little bit of rain mixing on in as temperatures rise into those mid to even upper 30s in some spots. So we're looking at an additional maybe one to three inches for tonight. And then Thursday, an additional maybe one to two, maybe even three inches in some spots. And then it gets really interesting by Saturday as a stronger low pressure system moves on in. Winds are starting to calm down right now, so that's not really a main topic at the moment, but they will start to pick up once again. Rockland, though, on the other hand, 18 mile an hour sustained winds. That means wind gusts closer to 30. It is blowing around some of that snow. They are under a winter storm warning. Windy conditions, pretty moderate snow. Yeah, not the best driving conditions, folks. Please be careful. Temperatures, though, wow, it's been looking nice for the southern part of the country. Not really here. New York City, it's been frigid there. Their average should be in the 40s. They were only in the 30s today. Of course, here in town, we're in the 20s, but lots of warm weather making its way up north. Even Chicago was in on some 50s earlier today. Our high temperatures were only in those upper 20s, some uh, low to even mid 20s up north. So of course, the snow is sticking around. It's very icy outside. Please be careful, folks. Tonight, temperatures will be hovering close to 20 degrees. We're looking at snow still lingering in the area. Pretty calm winds here in town by the coast by Rockland. Much stronger winds. Tomorrow, though, morning snow showers. Temperatures start to rise as we have some decrease in clouds throughout the day. Our extended forecast outlook does show the next snow event moving in on Thursday. We're in the clear for Friday, and guess what? Round three arrives once again into the weekend, especially into Saturday with several possible more inches of snowfall on the way. Beth?